Cheers is filmed before a live studio audience. Sam, table six wants a bottle of the house red. Woody, would you mind going to, uh, down to the wine cellar and getting some more, please? Of course not. You know, I used to be afraid of the dark, but uh, I got myself over it. Oh, yeah? How'd you do that? Oh, well, I just shut my eyes and pretended it wasn't there. Great old song, right up there with Yakety Yak. Yakety Yak? Mm. Oh, come on, you remember coasters, don't you? Oh. You're kidding. How about the Shirelles or the Platters or Dixie Cups? Sorry. You don't remember any of those old groups? Oh, old groups? You mean like Devo. <laughs> tonight. I was thinking about a high school football game, actually. It was a long time ago, Woody. I'm far away from here. We were playing our arch rivals for the state championship, you know? And I saw the cutest little cheerleader that I've ever seen in my life just cheering her heart out. Yeah, I, I looked at her, and the sun seemed to be shining only where she stood, you know? She seemed to be everything that was bright and pure and good. I knew right then and there that I wanted to make that little gal my wife. So I, I turned to Vera and I said, honey, would you mind introducing me to the cheerleader? <laughs> I'm joking, Woody. Of course, that little cheerleader was Vera. Hey, can I ask you a question, Mr. Peterson? Sure. Who won the game? I really couldn't tell you who won, Woody, but tonight, I sure know who lost. Well, can't you figure it out from that? <laughs> hey, I don't care what anybody says. We had better chatter out there. Shut up, Cliff. Sounds suspiciously as if there is no joy in Mudville. Who gives a damn? We lost. <laughs> We got dumped on. We were dragged by our noses through the dung heap. They ripped out our guts, held them up for us to see, and then they rammed them down our throats. Ah, uh, it's a grand old game. Damn. Now I know why they weren't afraid to let me play. They were great out there. They were like the 27 Yankees. He's exaggerating. There were only nine of them. <laughs> Let's go. I want to warm up. Hold on a second, guys. Say, Woody, still not too late to change your mind. Don't you understand? I maimed a man. Bowling accidents happen. You read about them in the paper all the time. <laughs> he was only an innocent maintenance man. Come on, man. He knew the risks. I still don't know what happened. You know, one minute I was picking up the 810 split. And the next thing I know, the ten pin flies and hits old Sully right between the eyes, and he goes down like a sack of wheat. Sam, I ruined the man's life. Oh, come on, I'm sure you're exaggerating. Oh, no, no, I'm not. Old Sully got too dim-witted to stay in bowling maintenance. Last I heard, he was a 
clown at children's birthday parties. Well, what's wrong with that? He wasn't invited to them. Listen, this is going to be tough on you. I want you to know that you don't have to do this, Woody. No, no, I want to, sir. You absolutely sure? Oh, I'm sure. You all have been like family to me. I love you guys. Okay, all right, Woody. Yeah, watch this, Gare. Yeah. <laughs> having second thoughts. That's okay, pal. No, no, I want to do this. Okay, I'm ready. All right. All right. Buddy! Oh. Woody? I want to do this, Sam. Remember, I love you guys. I'm ready, Sam. It's okay, Woody. I'm gonna ball. I don't know what I was worried about. It's just easy. Those guys are dead meat, you know what I'm saying, Sam? Oh, yeah, Woody, you ready to take on Carl in the uh, sports trivia contest? Yeah, well, now I've been studying all week long, so go ahead. Test me. All right. All right um... Uh, in what game did Ted Williams break his elbow? Ted who? <laughs> I'd take another quick peek in the book. Which, uh, 